It's review time. Problem 4 and 5. Algebraic problem. Number 4. Okay, here find the value of x. 3 times x minus 2 equals 5x minus 12. Let us have solution and reason. Okay, first is, of course, bring down the given. And we're going to multiply 3 to the term inside the parentheses. So we have 3x minus 6, bring down 5x minus 12 by distribution. Then we're so concerned with the value of x, so we're going to transpose 3x to other side, become negative 3x, and negative 12 to other side, positive 12. So we have 12 minus 6 equals 5x minus 3x. So we can subtract 12 minus 6 and 5x minus 3. So we have now 6x, uh, I mean 6 equals 2x. So we're going to multiply all equation by the inverse of 2, we have 1 half. Then distribute. Then we know 2 divided by 2 is 1, so x equals to 3. If you want to check whether our answer is right, let us use the value of x, which is 3, and substitute it to the original equation. So we have 3 times 3 minus 2 equals 5 times 3 minus 12. So we know 3 minus 2 is 1, 1 times 3 is 3 on the left side. On the right side, 5 times 3 is 15 minus 12, each, which is also 3. So we need to say the value of x, which is 3, satisfied the given problem. Okay, let us have another example about this, finding the value of a known. So we have here 5 times 2y minus 3 equals 8 plus 5. Do the same process, bring down the given. Then multiply 5 to the term inside the parentheses. We have 10y minus, 5, 15, uh, minus 15 equals bring down 8y plus 5. By distribution, then we're going to transpose 8y to other side. It becomes negative 8y. Negative 15 to other side becomes positive 15. So we have now 10y minus 8y plus, equals 5 plus 15. So 10y minus 8y is 2y. 5 plus 15 is 20. So again, we're going to uh, remove 2 by simply get the inverse of 2, which is 1 half. Then distribute it, then 2 divide itself, which, which is 1. So y equals 2, 10. Again, if we're going to find whether our answer is right or wrong, let us do the checking. Let us try to substitute 10 to all the y's in the given original equation. So 2 times 10 is 20, minus 3 is 17, then 17 times 5 is 85 equals 8 times 10 is 80 plus 5 is also 85 which means the value of y which is 10 satisfies the given problem i hope you learned something from this video good day and god bless everyone